The machining technology program is based upon teaching the students how to run the different machines. They got to run different machines to be able to produce parts. Those parts are assembled into a working component. The first machines you're going to be able to use are machines that anybody can have in any shop. You're going to learn how to use grinders, pedestal grinders, how to sharpen tools, how to make tooling. When you make a part, the surface finish isn't very good. So you can put it on a surface grinder, grind it down, and be able to make the surface finish really, really smooth. They're gonna start out with lathes. Lathes are machines that cut anything cylindrical. So you put the part in there and it will turn and cut the material on that cylindrical part. And then you're gonna get into the milling machines. The milling machines are going to be a part that's flat. After that, they're gonna move on to the CNC side. Now the CNC side is gonna be all computer driven. So they're gonna get in there and they're gonna learn how to write the code. What it does is it works off from the rectangular coordinate system used in math. So we got X and Y, we plot out locations. And then we tell code how to cut a part. So you're gonna learn how to run those machines. You're gonna have be able to um, select the tooling to use to cut the metal uh, and everything that you need to do to get a basic understanding of how to cut metal. The students are gonna get 100% hands-on experience. So we're gonna teach you a concept, how to do something, and then the instructor's always gonna be available to help you along the way. All my instructors either work in the field or they've had that background. The ideal student is somebody ready to learn. Um, they gotta be able to do it on their own in most cases. So you gotta be self-motivated. You gotta be wanting to do this. And if you like working with your hands, you like to build things, it is gonna be a great program for you. This program is going to make it so you are driving your own progress. You need to produce the parts in a certain amount of time to be able to succeed in this industry. Uh, so we like to, to teach the students that it's not about us doing it for you, it's about you doing it for yourself. Uh, and that's gonna get you ready for industry. There's a wide range of different career paths. If you like doing something, you wanna get into that field. You could build guns, you could build airplanes, you could build cars. Um, all this stuff that we have around us, it has to be machined by a machinist. And so whatever you're interested in, that's gonna be what's gonna drive a successful career. Uh, getting a job, there's no problem getting a job. Getting a job that you love doing every day, that is where it's gonna take some research on your behalf to be able to get in there and find the career where you want to, to stay at.